Good morning, Wayne and Christy. Happy Friday to you both. Okay, lots happening here like in less than 10 days. We have opening day. We have the Cleveland Independent Film Festival. We have the Eclipse. We have Dingus Day. We have the NCAA tournament. But let's get back to opening day. A big, big celebration. Excuse right here in Cleveland. And we're talking to some kids who are already in spring training. And uh, that's why we're at the DBAT facility. Uh, so before you pitch hit and catch. You have to get the right equipment. Pat, that's where you come in. Good morning. Good to see you, sir. Good morning. All right. We were laughing when we were kids. We got the Franklin glove at Sears and then went home. Right, <laughs> that exactly. was it. But now look at the, uh, we're in the pro shop here. And look at all the, the different types of gloves you guys have and stuff in the pro shop. Let's talk about that. Yeah, absolutely. So we're authorized Rawlings dealer. Um, so as you can see, our entire facility is filled with Rawlings and Mikan products. Okay. Uh, we focus on baseball, fast pitch, slow pitch. Um, and then also, too, like we were talking about with the Franklin gloves, you look yeah. at the difference between what it used to be to where it is now. There's so many different options, different types insane. of material. Absolutely. Yeah. Over here, which is really cool, you guys have a little center where you can customize a glove. Let's talk about this, Pat. Yeah, absolutely. So, like we talked about, a lot of things have come a long way. So, right now, we have the ability to actually customize our gloves. Okay. So, this kiosk right here allows us to pick our position, whether we're infield, outfield, wow. pitcher, go through our glove sizes, pick the type of pattern that we want. Mm -hmm. Now, we end up deciding left-handed, right-handed thrower, and then we can begin the customization process. And then, for an example, we have two... Uh, customized gloves here so everything I see here from the color of the Rawlings to the stitching everything that's what people can do they can customize just like this one here yeah absolutely so we can create uh, different types of binding different types of webbing our lacing wow. everything right there so any type of pretty much anything you could think of we can make happen in that aspect that's cool okay and you guys take that another step further as we come over here and talk about uniforms I remember we just we were like the green team there was just the different colors right. green purple red but now you guys can customize so people come over here and this looks like kind of like um, you know the the sampling of different colors that you would find in a paint store but right. these are for uniforms correct correct yeah so like you said it's kind of like going to Sherwin Williams yeah. you go out there you pick the colors that you want and again with technology coming a long way it used to be screen print on a t-shirt mm -hmm. now we have the ability to sublimate our materials so basically you're taking ink pressing it into the polyester and then it's dying it there so you're not going to get any pilling you any peeling example and it's going to come out really really nice for everybody wow not to mention uh we'll go back over to the bats um bats are a big part of uh of the game the technology with the bats from wood to um you know aluminum bats have, that's come a long way as well oh absolutely um right now again when we look at our products we have again all easton rawlings mm -hmm. When we talk about baseball bats, you look at the two hottest bats that are on the market right now. We're yeah. going to look at the Rawlings Mach AI, and we're mm -hmm. going to look at the Easton Hype. And then if we go to fast pitch, the Easton Ghost is one that wow. we can, we're barely able to keep that in stock right now. All right. Well, they have a pro shop here for all the kids. Check that for all the parents to buy right, for right. the kids. <laughs> when we come back, we're going to watch them uh, do some warm up there. I'm going to go ahead and take a shot out there so we can see our kids getting ready for baseball and softball season back to you guys in the studio yeah we've been there it's a great facility isn't it it's very nice yeah i think yeah. i hit a home run that day we were there i'm just saying I'm trying to remember that 